Johnson and Johnson and Johnson just reporting uh, its results. I want to get straight over to Meg Terrell, who's got those numbers. Meg. Good morning, Andrew. It's a beat for Johnson & Johnson on both earnings and revenue for the quarter. Uh, adjusted earnings per share were $2.20 versus an average analyst estimate of $1.98. Revenue coming in at $21.08 billion. Uh, analysts had estimated $20.2 um, on average, company also raising its full year guidance for sales by a billion dollars and adjusted EPS by 15 cents, citing what it calls the strength of recovery and strong underlying business fundamentals. Uh, they do also cite a better than expected procedure recovery for their medical devices unit, which was, of course, very hard hit by the pandemic, really seeing a beat across all of their segments, pharmaceuticals, medical devices and consumer products. That growth driven in the U.S. by products like Tylenol and digestive health, as well as Listerine. Um, the company also, of course, last night, news coming out that it had paused its COVID-19 vaccine trial dosing as they investigate an unexplained illness in the trial. Of course, guys, we don't know yet if this uh, the person was even on placebo or on uh, the vaccine, uh, but these are questions that will be uh, looked at, and it's being reviewed now by a data safety and monitoring board. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.